Hello friends, welcome you all to my YouTube channel. So today what we are going to do, we will download JDK 8. So we will type JDK 8 in our Chrome browser and then we can get these links. So before downloading, what I want, I want you to check in your command prompt if you have any Java version. For that, what do you have to do? You have to type Java space dash version and then hit enter. So as I don't have any Java version over here, so I didn't find anything. And if, if you will be having anything, you can get the version name over here. So what we will do now, we will go to J, uh, this link. And if I'll click on this link, it will take me to this window. So here you can see Java SE Development Kit JDK 8 U202. So here they have product file description, file size and download link. If you will scroll down, you can see there is an option for Windows 64 and here is the link for download. Once you will click on this link, it will show you this small window where you have to accept it first and then if you will click on this given link, it will take you to the Oracle sign in window so where you have to sign in once you will sign in or if you don't have any oracle account you have to create the account you have to click on the create account so uh, once you'll I, I just showing you how to do it once you, once you will go there on create account you can see this options so you have to create an account over there once you click on create account it will start downloading let me pause it over here and i will uh, log in through my email address and then it will start downloading i will show you how so i have already signed in <coughs> let's see how much time it will take to download for the jdk oops so it is downloading over here you can see and uh, let's go to the downloads let's go to see the downloads if the download has been completed you can go here and in your downloads you can see this jdk 8 u202 windows x64 so what you have to do here you will do double click on that and you you will allow this uh uh, this uh, JDK to install in your system. So just say yes. You need to keep on saying next, next, and it will start downloading and installing. It already downloaded, it will start installing in your system. Just wait for that. So what you have to do is, okay, next, it is installing, have patience, it might take just a little time, for some system it will be very very fast and for some systems it will take a little bit of time to download it. So have patience with this thing. It is getting installed. So what you have to do is just you can simply say close the system. You can see here JDK 8 updated successfully installed. So just close it. So what we have to do now, we will go to this PC and we have to open our window uh, like the the file in our window c the in the win in this drive we have to open it every person might have different um, drives so mine have this only c if i will open it where will i find find it out i can find that in program files and here you can see this java it has been installed over here and now you can see there are two options jdk 1.8 0, 2, 2, and JRE. So where we have to go, we have to go to JDK. And after that, we have to go to this bin. And once we are here, what we have to do, this path we have to select. And we have to copy this path. And after copying this path, we have to go our system setting. Once we'll go in our system settings, we have to go in the advanced setting. We, I have to find it out because 
this is the new one for me hmm let's do one thing we will directly search for advanced system setting let's close this and we will search directly advanced system settings if we'll go to advanced system settings in advanced system settings you can see environment variables click on that here you have two options variable for matches and system variables so what you have to do we will we, you have to go to system variables and then you have to select this path and then click on new then variable name and value you have to give over here once you'll double click on this path you'll get this another window for edit environment and variables so what you have to do here is you just click on new and you will find this uh, tab to pop up where you have to do the right click on this uh, cursor and you can find this paste option or you simply can do control v it will paste that path over there so what you have to do next is just click ok ok and ok now what you have to do you have to compile all the java files again in your command prompt so open it over there and what you have to do is just simply say java c oops uh, let me type it again java c so once you will hit enter over here it will compile all the files so now your jdk is ready to work i hope this video is helpful to download jdk in my next video i will show how to download eclipse and thank you for watching please do like share and subscribe if it really helped for you thank you very much